Oh, interesting. I was actually meant to wait for this to burn out. This door actually won't open right away at first. Yeah. It's less, it's like, it's less far behind than you would think it is at first glance. But it's far enough behind that it's extremely irritating. Yeah, last chance, kid. You pack it in now. I'll leave this dump to you and Frau Kraut. You keep on coming, and Ash the Raptor's a fish tank. Yeah, so there must be, yeah, like I said, the audio is very buggy on this game, I've noticed. That's, like, the biggest complaint I've had with this so far is just how, like, yeah, how flawed the actual audio is. Alright, let's just, uh, we don't need to listen to the audio. We've done this already. Find a big daddy already. Good, good, good. Let's actually go here. I just forgot. I forgot that I had like an ass ton of Adam in the uh, in the chamber. Um. Yeah, let's just go with that. Upgrade Eve. Upgrade health. And then let's upgrade some of our stuff. So let's go in Sin three. Electro 3 and route. But there's three more little sisters on this level, so we're gonna get three little sisters worth of Adam plus the last gift after each set of three. No, I think that the bug actually is ironically with the uh with the revamp. Um and likely just a uh, a byproduct of um of like you know they updated the graphics, but like you know, introduce a new bug in the process kind of thing. It's not like ideal or anything, but we'll uh, we won't we won't uh, we're not gonna we're not gonna be crying about it. Oh, I actually missed that diary last time. That's funny. So there's your answer, Ashikiza. I was actually a little bit wrong about that. They see he started working for uh, for Ryan more after Fontaine died. Can you stop getting in front of me, you stupid, useless piece of machinery? That actually just worked. I didn't realize that would actually just kill it. No, 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 no. 
the bright side, the fight with the daddy went much easier this time. <laughs> so there's that. Thank you, mister. You know what? I'm going to save. Before going into a potentially bugged out area. Thank you. Um, the remaster was, I don't know, I want to say four or five years ago, give or take, but I'm really not 100% sure. Oh. Where is this person? Oh, hi. That's not what I assume would be happening. Oh. You think turning yourself into one of those tin men is a two-way street? The crowd's holding auditions for the Frankenstein parade, and you're first in line. All right, time to modulate our voice box. One down, two steps to go. Now, you need only to be finding the bodysuit and the pheromones from the other labs. What you wait for, engraved invitation. Good lord, I'm calm the fuck down. <laughs> God damn. I was just kidding. I uh, I'm back. I know you're here. Come on. I just want to Don't fucking judge. Me. You ran off. Why they always run off? Thanks. Nice. Okay. No, it's not about the firepower. To, to be to be fair, it's about uh, making yourself believable to an un uh, to a little sister. This is yeah. This is a, this is not about um, like being more effective as a big daddy. It's about being believable as a big daddy to the. Uh... Oh dear. Okay. Oh, hi. Didn't see you there. Where did that guy go? Who is that? I'm gonna show you. I didn't mean to hurt anyone. Shit! Looks like he gave up. Like a woman. Like a woman? Holy shit, I've never heard that voice line before. I mean, I guess, again, this is like, you know. 1950s America or pseudo America, but damn, that's a uh, that's a little much. That's a little much.
Oh, yeah, this Fontaine one. showed some foresight when he built up the plasmid business, but the man really never understood sales. Hiding. Well, their uh, little sisters are combat effective because they're essentially indestructible. You like, like you can like you can like use like surgical precision to to kill one. Like I think that's what the harvest thing is like basically if you because you basically like dig into their bodies and rip the because like okay so it's not like super well explained in this Bioshock. I think they actually clarified a little bit more in the second one. Um, basically, little sisters are the byproduct of basically just taking normal little girls and um. Uh, surgically implanting them with uh, uh, the uh, the slugs that were referred to uh, briefly um, in, uh, in uh, one of the in one of the earlier uh, audio uh, logs, and what the slugs do is essentially um, is they, they're, they're the atom factories, but they don't work well by themselves, and so they found out that basically they could implant them into little girls and turn them into just walking atom factories. Um, and so basically, and as long as the little sisters are embedded with the, uh, with the slugs, they're essentially just unkillable. They're, they're functionally indestructible. Um, so that, so they are actually more combat effective than you would imagine. If only because it's just really freaking hard to kill them. I don't know if I'll ever get bored of watching that particular animation happen. It's just so absurdly unnecessary and yet very amusing. Good lord. She's dead! Calm down! Oh, did you notice? That was my voice, by the way, when I got hit. I made the uh, the big daddy uh, uh, grunt of pain. Because now my voice box has been modulated to sound like Big Daddy. Nineteen twenty one, thank you. You play in a bad hand, kid. You just too splice to smell it. Roll on back to Mother Goose now, or evidence gonna go busto. <laughs> Sounds like he's panicking. Just for good measure, we're gonna get some bees. Groups of enemies attack lots of enemies at the same time. It was it was always a feature that I thought was a little bit um contrived or like not no not contrived. It was a little bit weird that when your when your powers go haywire, it includes giving you powers you don't actually have. It felt a little bizarre to me, shall we say? But whatever. End of the day, it's not uh, not the end of the world, but it is really weird. It is undeniably very weird. And now I have bees. I 
Like, he doesn't fully follow. It's basically making an assumption. Yeah, exa exactly. I don't I don't know why. I don't know exactly why, but whatever. It is it is what it is. You know? You made me! You made me! I need everyone to calm the fuck down. Actually, like not finish my research track here. No, that was bad timing. That was bad timing. I didn't realize that she was already committed to going away. She doesn't need to go. She doesn't need to cycle the airlock, apparently. Okay, you. Come out to where I have. Yeah, yeah, you. Okay, now, now turn around. Thank you. Address the threat. Yes, good. Good. Oh, oh that, that didn't. Oh, that didn't. That didn't work at all. Yeah, you're right. I probably should have just died. <laughs> Where do you think you're going? You need to become a big daddy before you are able to throw out the little one. Kevin Bong actually has no chill. My picture so much. Okay, hi. Now you will have need of bodysuit, 
und Helmet. So now I've got the boot, so... It is cool that they sync up the audio cues to like the, the Big Daddy noise. I, I, did, I always did find that kind of cool. I can't see my own feet, which is a bit of a shame, but... Also, in my mind, this is the librarian, and she was just really mad that I was making too much noise in the library. That's my, uh... That's my headcanon for that. Dang, that thing dropped three health kits? You love to see it. fault is that, you dick? Shame things turned out this way, kid. You and me could have run the table in this place. Now there's nothing left for you but a long, cold Wait, oh, there you are. Calm down, calm down. Nothing to see here. It is nice to be able to just walk through those with impunity. Ironically, I can't tell if that's me or him. Her. Them. God damn it. The big daddy boots need to be shipped to here, not the damn library. What kind of idiot is Ryan hiring in our date? This kind of bullshit never happened on the Fontaine. Ryan sent over extra munitions. He must have suspected trouble. I will lock them up near the protector labs and set the code to 1921. That just auto played if anyone's wondering. Them, Once Big Daddy is ready, nobody cross the Big Daddy. I'm just gonna spam picture this because like basically every little bit of progress is worth it. Job turn what? Good lord. Bubble. Mr. Bubble. Suspect. No. Very suspect. No. 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 Sutron definitely seems like the passive aggressive type that way. Are we are we surprised? Are we surprised? Thank you. Useless Thank piece of shit. <laughs> Cheap son of a bitch. You can no reuse protect us suit. Take them 
man grabbed the skin and organs straight in the suit. Otherwise, your suit will not work. Ryan say Big Daddy too expensive. Ryan can go suck an egg. This is basically where they would like surgically implant the big daddies. This is where you find the body suit. Which one should I take? So many options. You know, you should be thanking me. Oh, I yeah. brought you here. I showed you who you are. Nobody never told you nothing but lies till I come along. Wonderbar. <laughs> All you need now is helmet. This is confusing. A bit of a maze. Oh, so I missed where the this is, I guess. Oh, no, 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 no. I see what this is now. I see what's going on. I see what's going on. Alright, this is it. Daddy time. Look at you. We will make Big Daddy out of you yet, I think. There is only one piece missing. The pheromones. Go to the little one educational that. facility. Luckily, mine is not. I'm essentially just cosplaying. Uh, mine is not welded, but yeah, consider uh, the implications of that for a minute. All right, well, enjoy the fisheye for the next little bit, because unfortunately that's, uh, that's what we're dealing with for the rest of the game. I actually, like, probably should have considered, like... Ah! <laughs> 
I don't think that's the uh, regular animation. Pardon me? Like up here? I didn't touch her! With the vacuum? I don't think you're. No. Okay, uh, one second. One, one second, chat. One second. It's not a wet dry. Did you look this up? No, it's not a wet dry. I don't know what you want me to tell you, but not with our vacuum cleaner. <laughs> Sigh. Sorry, hon. So where was the- there was a stairs up- oh, there it is. There it is. Find a better hiding place, monster. I can see you! Uh, I'm not hiding? Question mark? Have I become so convinced by my own beliefs that I have stopped seeing the truth? Perhaps. But Atlas is out there, and he aims to destroy me and to destroy my city. To question is to surrender. I will not question. Oh, yes. The mark of the person who is ready to learn. Not questioning anything. Oh damn, that was bad. Another little one with a token of our appreciation. Ryan is the Ryan is uh, clearly the original. No, it's the kid. It's the kids who are wrong. putting on aftershave. You will need three industrial applications of this stuff, and then the little ones will be drawn to you like a bee to honey. You will have to gather three pheromones here, so that you smell disgusting. Just like a big daddy. Perfect. 
be glad I am nowhere near you and that awful sink. Why the little ones are drawn to the smell of those pheromones is beyond anything I can understand. You push me too far, kid. When you're cold and stiff, I'm gonna go over to Mother Goose's house. Yeah, you're right. And I'm gonna take it apart, piece by piece, and brat by brat. I know why it has to be children, but why just girls? This I cannot determine why, but I know it is so. Fontaine says, ah, oh, one less bathroom to build since the orphanage. It is amazing to watch the effect of Adam on their small bodies. Their own cells replaced by the new stems the instant they are damaged. These children are practically invulnerable. It is a shame you could not do the same thing to an adult. There would be quite a market for a man you could not kill. Um, because they're not invulnerable to having the slugs physically ripped out of them. Like, you could punch one and, and shoot one as long as you wanted it, and it would be fine. But if you just take one and, like, physically restrain her and rip the slug out, there's nothing they can do about that. That's, uh, essentially the idea. Yes. Now this is a big daddy. Are you ready? Now go to the little sister vent by the proving grounds. All the sort of like the uh, little teaching boards here. All good girls gather. Here's the indoctrination here. And this is why you keep hearing them be like, look, Mr. Bubbles, an angel. Because like that's, that's what they're taught they are. Oh yeah, that's what it is. Basically look at, yeah. So basically this is, see inter, if they interact, basically interacting with an actual human results in me getting a pain stimulus, but interacting with the daddy gets me reward. So there's some like straight up Pavlovian shit going on there. Uh, that's not Pavlovian actually, that's um... Oh, is that, oh, is that Watson? 
Was Watson the one that did like the pain, the pain therapy, like as a as a reward thing? I can't quite remember. I feel like it was Watson. Watson was like the particularly, like the explicitly morally bankrupt one. So this dude just got stabbed to living shit by a bunch of fucking uh, little sister needles. So th there's your combat effectiveness right there. Ah, found my director's commentary. Nice, nice. Oh no, it's not Watson, it's I think it's Skinner. I think Skinner is the one I'm thinking of. Um that did some like particularly uh uh unethical uh like human like human conditioning shit. I think it's Skinner that I'm talking uh, that I'm thinking about, but again I'm not one hundred percent sure. This is like forcing me to go back to my like psych 101 uh lectures. Into that room in a second. I always thought this was very creepy the lamp like shining out from under the bed. Yes, yes, game prompts, I know. You might be right. You might be right. Pat mobile games. Yeah, that too. Like I said, I know for a fact that there was some kind of... Oh dear. What the hell's with that music? I know for a fact that there was some kind of scientist that did like... Sister dresses, you know, just the same. <laughs> just point blank bolt to the face. Sorry. So I am essentially indistinguish indistinguishable from a big daddy now, is the uh, the idea. and then they'll let you in the door. Go on, hit the vent with your wrench. Alright, let's save here. Just 
in case. to me if you will be gentle with the girl. My kleine Schmerzchen. Yes. I needed to get through the door. Just get a No, I have to be a big daddy. God. Like, it sounds like she's right next to me, this random splicer woman, and she's just very obviously not. Anyway. All right. It's the final showdown. The little ones will lead you to Fontaine, hurry, but you hurry, must protect them. Oh, that's what this is. This is basically just like, all right, stock up. This is it, folks. All right, let's auto hack. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Um, buy some grenades. Yes, yes, yes. I can buy one more set of grenades. Yeah. gonna like be better about saving i've been really really glib about saving because like if i die it doesn't matter but as we just saw there are some reasons that you want to be saving more proactively Physically, three of them, yeah. Chung's mental condition is still holds them to that terrible task. 
or sin such as this. You can never recall. Let's save here. I'm ahead of you! Like 99% sure you're going the wrong way, child. Where are you going? Did she break? Hurry! Hurry, Mr. Okay. Bubbles! Don't be a slope, Mr. B. Angels don't wait for slow folks. All right. Watch out! This For certain, their harvesting will draw the attention of this one. Let's save again. As we're starting the second one. Still gathering. Save here, because this is where this is actually where we got she got obliterated by the uh, friggin' rocket launcher. <laughs> Didn't like that. Didn't like that one bit. Oh my goodness. K. 
Can you not, though? A rapture of iron. We all have to stay. A temptation break to make a little extra out of it. Hurry, Mr. B. Not. Stay on the level. Right. That got done nice and easy. Hurry, Mr. B. Makes a big difference when she's not just at half health going into the final uh, the final gather. So did you see her arms glow there? Apparently that's the uh, the hallmark of the of like the, uh, the the slug doing its work. Oh my god, I'm so slow. Uh, Alright, well she took some damage there, but again, I guess acceptable. Not as much. Basically, whenever her arms flare yellow like that, it's the uh, it's the slug just like insta like insta reviving her. That's why she was able to walk through the, um... Walk through the electrical water without just getting, like, wrecked. I might have actually forgotten to save there, so I'm glad that that didn't just blow up in my face, either figuratively or literally. Oh, well, they're not triggering on me because I hacked them. I've just been, like, very, very aggressively and proactively hacking them. Don't progress the story for a second. All right, well, I'm just going to keep walking through the hallways. There isn't going to be a ton of progress. Dancing in the sky. We're just, we're just kind of forging on. Oh dear. No! <laughs> Do a barrel roll or something. Better for the girls to be with you. Better with you than alone. Alone in the crawling darkness. Time to go, Mr. B. Yes, yes, yes. Hurry, Mr. B. Where are you? Angels Let's go. are waiting for our kisses. Slowpoke, Mr. B. 
angels don't wait for slow pokes. Just fire on the other side. Hurry, Mr. Blue. I can see the angel. I might be playing for a week of scrubs and a pencil pushes, but I need more. More! I want a splice! There ain't nothing left to splice with! Why the dead cats always? Uh, you missed me just, like, yeeting a big daddy, like, real hard. He tried to steal the little sister from me, and I kicked his ass real bad. And there was a really funny physics thing where he just kind of did a bit of a backflip. Sort of like a weird, uh, like, acceleration physics thing. Fontaine is nearby. You are reaching close now. Just all of the restock. You must use the needle of the little sister to drain Fontaine of his Adam. It is the only way to defeat him. So much extra atom. What are you waiting for? Pick up the needle. Right, where? This? Where is the needle? Am I the only one losing it? Oh, I see. There. Got it. Fontaine waits above. There will be no going back from here. Make sure you are ready to face him before moving on. <laughs> Thank you, Doctor. Do this thing. I'm sure it'll auto save me as I go up. You know, whatever. Better safe than sorry. Um. Oh, uh, there was also a dead cat. No dead dogs, but there was a dead cat, which I, once again, just don't understand why video games insist on just murdering cats indiscriminately like that. It's just not cool. All right, let's take this fucker down. I remember when me and the crowd put you in that sub. You were no more than two. You were my ace in the hole. But you were also the closest thing I ever had to a son. And that's why this hurts. But Rail kid, life ain't strictly business. <laughs> I can take a picture of him. No subject in view. What the hell are you looking at? You got 
think I'm alone in this world? I got more than enough mugs to watch my back while I recharge. Not the best part of the fight in the world, but it really wasn't about the boss fight. I, I sent you topside. I called you back, showed you what you was, what you was capable of. Even that life you thought you had, that was something I dreamed up and I tattooed inside your head. Now, if you don't call that family, I don't know what it is. And now. <laughs> what was that you were saying about little sisters, uh, Kiza, and how uh, how we could uh, how we could rely on them? It's good shit. They offered you this city. And you refused it. And what did you do instead? <laughs> what I've come to expect of you. you I'm not actually sure about the voice actor part. You gave them the one thing that was stolen from them. A chance. A chance to learn. To find love. To live. And in the end, what was your reward? You never said. But I think I know. A family. And there we have it. Bioshock the first. That was fun, chat. I enjoyed going back through that with you folks. Excited to do it again with Bioshock 2. Yeah, that is for sure. Yeah. 